Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how you can get these nice themes for Cura 5. Here we have the green one. And let's look at the second one. And here you have the brown one. As you can see, it's a very beautiful theme. I'm going to show you how you can get these themes. Well, first thing you download the files. The links are available in the description. After you download the files, here we have for the brown theme and here for the green theme. So there are two ways to install the themes. The first way, you go to the folder programs to make a cura 5.0.0 .0. share cura resources and themes here you have all the themes that are installed for your for your cura now i copy the files and paste them in this folder There are two folders for the themes of Cura, that is Cura Drag and Cura Light. I renamed them, for example, Cura Dark Old. And this one I renamed it Cura Light Old. After that, I renamed my new folders Cura Dark and Cura Light. For example, the Cura Brown, I can rename the folder. Cura drag and for the green theme I rename the folder Cura light okay now when I open Cura and here I have my brown theme let's look at the green theme I choose green here. I close Cura and I open it again. And here it is. I have my green theme. So this is the first method. Okay, for the second method, first I come to the same folder that is programs, Ultimate Cura 500, share Cura resources and themes, and I rename these two folders, Cura Dark and Cura Light. I rename them, for example, Cura Dark Old and Cura Light Old. I've remained my two folders. Now I can close this folder. Now I copy my two themes. Okay, now I open the Explorer. I go to Display and I check this box Show Hidden Elements to show the hidden folders. Now I go to Users. I choose my username. I open the hidden folder updater here. Then roaming. After I open the folder Cura here. Then the folder 5.0. And then the folder themes. As you can see here, initially the folder is empty. Now I copy my themes and I paste them in this folder. Now I rename the folders, for example, the Cura Brown. 
I rename it Cura Drug. And the Cura Green, I rename Cura Light. Now I can close my folders and open Cura. Okay, here it is. Here I have my my green theme. Now let us check the brown theme. I select brown here. Now I close Cura and I open it again. And there it is. I have my brown theme. But I have noticed a little issue here concerning the X axis, Y and Z axis. For example, here I have green for the X axis, red for the Y axis, and yellow for the Z axis. For the X axis, there is no problem, it's okay. But I've noted that there is an inversion of the colors between the Y axis and the, and the Z axis. For example, here, if I look at the configuration file, here, for example, for the X axis, the RGB colors, I have 0, 255, and 0, which is green, and that's okay for the X axis. But look here for the Y axis, I put 255, 255, and 0, which is normally yellow, but the yellow appears on the, on the Z axis. And here, for the D axis, I put 255, 0, and 0, which is red, and the red appears on the Y axis. Now, let me show you. For example, here I'm going to change the, the Y axis. Instead of red, I'm going to put blue. That is 0, 0, 255. That's blue. And for the Z axis, I'm going to put yellow. That is 255, 255 and 0. Now I save the file. I open Cura again. As you can see here, in the configuration file, I put blue for the Y axis here. But the blue appears on the D axis. I put Z yellow for the Z axis and the yellow appears on the Y axis. Let's change again. I put yellow for the Y axis. That is 255, 255 and 0. Now I put red for the Z axis. That is 255, 0 and 0. I save the file. I open Kira again. Okay, as you can see here, for the x-axis, I put green. It came green. That's okay. For the y-axis, I put yellow. It came red instead of yellow. For the z-axis, I put red. It came yellow instead of red. So there is an inversion between the y-axis and the z-axis about the colors. Maybe the Cura team would look at that and try to solve the issue or if anybody has the solution, please share it with, with me. Thank you very much.